Well, hello, my friends. This is Billy Bob. Just wanted to say hello and see how you're all doing today. You know, let me ask you a question and to see how many people respond. What color is your hair? Type it in the comments below. Is you, you have brown hair, you have green hair, red hair, purple hair, you have gray hair. Tell me what kind of hair you have. You don't have no hair. <laughs> I know somebody has a little curly cue on top of their bald head, and it's so cute. I love rubbing that little thing hair. <laughs> Anyhow, what color hair do you have? Just tell me. I'm just curious. Well, today I'm going to ask a question because somebody asked me, how can I get a, a like a nice raise, Billy Bob? You know, I work at a at a manufacturing plant and I put things together. I don't know. He didn't tell me exactly what he does. And this is a shout out for that question. It comes from Russell Martin. Russell Martin, if you're out there, just know that I'm doing this one for you, baby. Anyhow, so Russell Martin said, how can I get a raise? Because, you know, he's got a family. He's got a baby now coming on the way, little baby. I told him to name, name him Billy Bob, and he said, ain't going to do that. <laughs> I didn't think that was too nice. Anyway, so there's a lot of ways you can get a raise. But one of the best ways to get a raise, and people just don't think of it this way, let's say you spend, I don't know, $5,000 a month on your bills. Your car, your house, your food, your car insurance, house insurance, I don't know, all, all the stuff you have is $5,000 a month. And let's say you're making $5,000 a month, so you don't have no money left over when you're done. And a lot of people come to me and say, well, Billy Bob, I need a raise. You think you can talk to my boss for me? Heck no, I'm not going to talk to your boss. I don't even know who the heck you are. I love you. I care about you. But I'm not going to get that into, into the weeds, you know. I, I don't know. I don't know your boss. I might get you fired. Some people just don't like the way I talk. So the best thing you could do is you can't control somebody else. It's really hard to do that. Now, you can ask your boss. First thing I would do is I'd go up to my boss and say, Hey, boss man. Hey, boss lady. Um, can I ask you a question, please? I, my family's growing. I got another baby on the way. Or I just got married or I just got divorced. Whatever your situation is that, that needs more money. And you say, what can I do to get a raise? Just ask the question. And can you, can you please help me out? Just give me details on what I can do to get a raise. I need to make an extra $1,000 a month. And I, I would appreciate details if you can do that for me. And I'll do whatever I can to get there. And so they'll give you a list. You know, maybe you get smarter. Maybe get some more skills. Maybe work harder. Maybe work longer hours. Maybe they'll let you work overtime. Something like that, right? But that's one thing you can do. The other thing you can do, and I just did a, a, a podcast on this a, a few days ago, is figure out what you can do in your house to save money. Imagine if you could save $300 a month by cutting your expenses, changing your car insurance to a different car insurance, putting a higher deductible on your car insurance. Um, I don't know, eating, instead of eating uh, steak dinners every day at home, even if you're cooking at home, because it's, it's expensive everywhere nowadays. Everything's expensive. I understand, people. Instead of eating uh, steak every day, when you go to the grocery store, just stop buying steak. Start buying chicken. And use A1 steak sauce on it to make it taste like steak. I don't know. Maybe it works. I tasted some chicken one time. It tasted like steak. You know, they always say tastes like chicken. No, my, my chicken tasted like steak. Anyhow, save the money. Because $300 a month, that's $3,600 a year raise. So there's things you can do in your own house, within your own budget, to reduce expenses. I know somebody in my family bought a Lexus. The person don't have money to, to pay attention. The, the person don't have money to, to buy a bag of pretzels. But they bought a Lexus. I'm like, why would you buy that car? How much are you paying? Five fifty a month? Go trade that car back in and go find yourself a little Toyota. You just got to get to work, honey. You don't have to do all this fancy stuff. You don't have to look like you're rich when you're broke. Well, so she did that. And now her car payment went down $200 a month. She's saving $2,000 a year. So that's a $2,000 raise. So do things like that, things that you can do, and at the same time, learn new skills and be a better employee. So I hope this helps. This is Billy Bob, this is Asian Redneck Show. I love you. I just want you to have a better life. Have a good day. Have a good night. And have a nice life.